In this video, we will be comparing the graph of a function and its derivative. Remember that the derivative is the slope of the tangent line to the function. So as we're doing this, just remember that when you're talking about derivative, you're talking about the slope of the original function. So we will be comparing the graph of a function f of x equal x squared plus x minus 3. And that's this parabola shown in black. The turning point or the vertex it has coordinates negative 1 half, negative 3 and a fourth. And we're comparing that function with the graph of its derivative, which is f prime of x equals 2x plus 1. And its derivative is shown here in red. So our function has a negative slope. And remember, when you're looking for the slope, you're looking at the slope of the tangent line. So at any given point, for example, this point right here, the tangent line represented by this uh, piece of pasta is shown here. And the tangent line just touches the curve at, at one point all the way. So we have a negative slope of my tangent line until I reach the vertex. And at the vertex, my tangent line becomes horizontal. And then when I move around to the right side of the parabola, the tangent line has a positive slope. And it gets steeper and steeper as I go up on my points. So my point here, tangent line would be look something like that. And that's a positive slope. So on the left side of the parabola, over on the left side of the vertex of the parabola, I have a negative slope for my tangent line. And then at the vertex, my slope is 0 because my tangent line is horizontal. And then on the right side, my tangent line has a positive slope. So notice then that the function has a negative slope on the interval from negative infinity to negative 1 half. So when x is negative to infinity all the way up to x is a negative 1 half, my uh, function has a negative slope. Also notice that the graph of the derivative is below the x-axis. So from negative infinity up to x equal negative 1 half, my red line here, that section of the graph, is below the x-axis, down below here. Then when my function has a zero slope, so in other words, at the vertex, at the turning point, my um, tangent line is going to be horizontal here. The slope of a horizontal line is zero. And so at that vertex, at x equal negative one half, my derivative crosses the x-axis. So the value of my derivative is zero. And then notice that on the right side of the parabola here, my tangent line will have a positive slope on at any given point on the right side of the parabola. So my derivative, which is this red line right here, the graph of that will be above the x-axis. Also notice that when my function is second degree, my derivative is first degree. So my function was a parabola, a quadratic equation. My derivative, which is f prime of x, is a linear equation.